Yeah, today I want to speak uh, <clears throat> about pranayama, about proper breathing exercises in yoga. So it's uh, it's uh, I'm not gonna show anything, but uh, I'm gonna explain to you uh, because to show you need uh, a special guru to do pranayama to do breathing exercises with yoga uh, without like good guru good teacher good master uh, could be many problems you can do even damage so even uh, once uh, Sri Aurobindo it's a like very big master like one of the like biggest ever uh, he overdid pranayama like over like too much he did too much so he was like almost two years in the hospital you know like it uh, because uh, pranayama you work with your energy with your mind you know it's it's very uh, unique thing and very delicate so uh, I'm gonna speak in pranayama in a way uh, not about exercises because like I told you study it with the uh, proper guru but I'm gonna explain like what is it what's uh, what it's for like uh, why it helps why you need to do that let's say and uh, how it helps what does it mean that you're in yoga like uh, in the yoga system uh, we have uh, first like uh, I'm talking about classical one like about uh, Patanjali yoga about Raja yoga also King yoga and Shivananda yoga very close to it it's like a little mix but still it's a eight limbs yoga also it, eight steps eight levels so yama niyama first two ones it's like about moral qualities and qualities you need uh, to have to study yoga and uh, asana f video about asana uh, asana's proper poses uh, stretching exercises so uh, welcome to see it to watch it maybe it's better yeah and uh, next it goes asana pranayama it's next step like uh, it doesn't mean it's supposed to be like one after another exactly uh, you can mix them but you have to ask your teacher and listen to your body like everybody is different so pranayama is not like it more advanced than asanas let's say uh, it's not that it's asana then uh, um, pranayama dharana it means uh, uh, i mean pratyahara it means like uh, you work with your emotions you control in your emotions dharana it's concentration meditation it's dhyana in sanskrit and uh, the last one it's a goal in yoga especially in Raja yoga at least uh, it's enlightenment yes Samadhi so and, uh, and I'm doing the videos uh, about all of them like separately uh, I have video like together like uh, I'm talking about the system like how they connect to each other it's very important to understand it otherwise you uh, like in a deep forest like you don't know what, which way to go so pranayama uh, <clears throat> especially uh, it speaks for itself pranayama it if you translate it from sanskrit it's um, it means controlling prana pretty much uh, controlling your energy and of course controlling your feelings if you're controlling your energy if you control your breathing you control your feelings your emotions even doctors knows that so it's uh, a lot of uh, 
not in just in yoga, a lot of uh, uh, different systems, different breathing exercises for many problems. Doctors like from like regular medicine, like traditional medicine, even use it. So, but in yoga, it's uh, much more deeper. Um, in yoga, when you do pranayama, it means you're working with your uh, astral body, with the chakras, with your energy channels. <laughs> it's gonna be another video about chakras. Don't worry about that right now. If you don't know that. Uh, so about uh, your energy challenge and about your energy centers you can say that it connected to your glands to your uh, to your body of course to your mind so um, the pranayama you basically you uh, collecting the prana and you're using it the proper way for yourself like uh, to heal yourself to uh, awaken kundalini like the energy you you're using it for uh, to be more alive to the uh, from the depression it's very good for, from anxiety it's very good to calm your mind to balance your mind to balance your whole system so uh, it's many ex exercises like uh, uh, when you <clears throat> to wake up in the morning better one of them uh, uh, helping you to uh, deal with the toxins in your body they go out of you and uh, for the memory is good and you uh, actually much easier to think when you work like with computer and stuff it's uh, uh, it's it's much easier you have my much lighter head like uh, I can't even explain it how it feels you should practice it and then you 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 know it it's kind of meditation also so the goal is it's uh, cleaning your energy challenge from the from the old or the new ones uh, blockages energy blockages uh, of prana like uh, with emotions uh, old memories you can say that you're working with the karma you basically